the greatest responsibility in your life is to be in control of your own thoughts. People have 60 to 70,000 thoughts going through their head a day. Most are negative. Time to freaking reprogram. Hey guys, Andy Elliott here today, and I'm here with a short video to tell you probably the greatest advice you'll ever get in your life, which is the number one way to change your life. And by the way, how would I know how to give the video the best advice how to change your life? Because I changed mine. Number one, I built a nine-figure business in the last three or four years, okay? I'm on fire with my wife. I'm a badass parent to my kids. I literally have done more than anyone else said that I would do. I've overcome the craziest obstacles. I am the comeback kid. And so if you wanna be the comeback kid, if you wanna come back from anything, if you wanna change your life right now, I'll show you how to do it. Number one, write this down. You gotta change my identity. Listen, every single thing in your life comes down to who you think you are. And by the way, who you think you are, your identity, who you believe you are, is how you'll behave, it's how you'll treat people, it's how you'll do things, it's the business you build, it's, it's, it's the way you study, it's the way you learn, it's the way that you perceive the world, it's the way that you think the world perceives you. All this is done by an identity. And what I did is I basically, I'm just gonna be straight up, man. This is how easy it is. And, and you can do it right now, it's a simple decision. You can just make a decision to totally recreate yourself, reprogram yourself, and just be a different person. Um, I wanna tell you, I was training with Patrick Bet David. I was in an event. I decided to change my life, okay? 2019, it's 2024 at the time I'm shooting this. And in 2020, I went to a conference. I go to a conference every quarter, okay? Called The Vault. And Patrick Bet David talked about something called future truth. I want you to write that down, future truth. What does that mean? Does that mean it's true today? No, it means that it's in the future it'll be true. And I remember as he was explaining this, and, and by the way, I operate from a state of madness, okay? You know, I had a lot of people bet against me, and uh, I'm burning those people's eyes out. I'm thinking in my head, I, I'm going to burn their eyes out with my winning. I'm going to make it. There's no way in hell they're going to be right about me. Okay, I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna win, I'm gonna be the comeback kid, I'm gonna come back. And then I've got my wife that always believed in me. And I'm like, if you got somebody that's gonna believe in you, I'm not gonna let her down. And I was like, I need to make a change. And I'm ready and I'm serious. And I know a lot of you guys right now are serious too and I'm gonna tell you how to do it. He said future truth. He said basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna write down who do you wanna be and all the way from like, what do you wanna look like? And like, I'm in really good shape. I mean, I mean, I take, I take really good care of myself. I'm very lean, I'm 44, I'm 44 years old. Um, and I just say this as a point of like zero, like pride, ego, or entitlement. I say it with full confidence that everyone on the other side of this camera right now can totally transform and change your life from, from physical condition to mental condition to, to financial condition to everything, okay? Um, but he said, you know, like, like, what, like what do you wanna look like? Um, how do you want to behave? How do you want to treat people? What's the way that you want to love people? How do you want people to see you? How are you going to walk? How are you going to talk? Like, how are you going to operate with your team? Like, what kind of standards are you going to have? How are you, like, what triggers you? What makes you angry? How can you stay calm? How can you, it's like all these things, like who I wanted to be, based, basically my ethos, my identity, who I want to be, future truth. What was I going to do? And who did I want to become? And I literally told myself a lie, straight up. I'm gonna give you permission to lie right now. People say, don't lie, lie. I told myself that I was this person. And people say, well, that's imposter syndrome. That's this, that's stupid. Okay, okay, let me tell you what happens next. So I tell myself this lie that I'm this person. And honestly, I became delusional. I was like, all right, that's me. That's who I'm gonna be. And I started behaving that way. I started working like I was that person. I started acting. I started acting totally different. I started speaking different, talking different. Yeah, Self-esteem, self-belief, self-confidence, all these things raised. I kept my word, okay? I kept my word, you know, not, not, not to just to other people, but to myself. Well, if I said I was gonna get up at 5 a.m., I got up 5 a.m. No, Non-negotiables, no questions asked. I did it, no matter what. I fell in love with doing the things that I hated, and I did them like I loved them. I literally became a different creature and a different human being. And you know what happened? A little bit of time went by and I became that person. I'm not even joking. I remember making the decision that day 
that I needed to change my identity. See, because you live with yourself, 25-7, 365. People can think this is stupid, that's fine. Turn this off, keep the life you have. Stay the same. Or those of you that are crazy enough to change and only successful people, right? The ones that, that really make it, those people are crazy. You crack open any really successful person, they're crazy. They told themselves who they were before the world identified who they were, before the market said they were that person, and before anyone else had evidence that they were that person. They were saying that they're that person. That's the way it works, okay? And so I made a decision that that was who I was gonna be, and I'm gonna tell you what happened. I started changing, I started treating people differently, I started treating myself differently. My internal dialogue that I was having with myself was totally different. I started talking to myself different. Listen, you're the gatekeeper to your mind. The greatest responsibility in your life is to be in control of your own thoughts. People have 60 to 70,000 thoughts going through their head a day. Most are negative. Time to freaking reprogram. And that's what I did. And so I started studying, finding information, new leadership training, sales training, you know, like just self-development. I, I totally immersed, right down to total immersion. I totally immersed in new content, new information, being around new people, a new mindset, new way of thinking, a new way to see things. I went to events all the time because I needed to be around positive people, like-minded people that wanted to become how I wanted to become. And, uh, and obviously I audited anything that was negative in my life so I could get it away from me. And future truth. I woke up and you know, a couple years have passed. I now live in Scottsdale, Arizona. I've got a team of 100 killers. They're awesome, amazing people, super loving, amazing. They're called Elliot Army. I'm sure you know who they are. I have thousands of people request to work for my company a day and we're not hiring, okay? I know a lot of companies that want to hire people and can't hire anybody. And I have a thousand people every day ask me, to, Andy, can I work for you? Very high level people want to walk away from their jobs to come work for a culture like mine. Me and my wife are on fire. My kids choose me as their hero. They're amazing. Okay, I'm in the best shape of my life, super healthy. And I have a very rich life. And I don't mean with money. I mean, I love my life. And I built a nine figure business. Change your identity reprogram yourself when you change everything changes I'm gonna tell you a couple reasons why you want to change number one everybody has people that look up to them and watch them you guys all have someone watching you little brother little sister mom dad grandma grandpa neighbor nephew niece I don't know someone's watching you okay and you're probably letting them down don't do it if there's one person that believes in you, it's enough to change. And by the way, listen, there was even a point, my wife's always believed in me, but there was a point where, you know, like I needed to believe in me. I needed to know that a person like me that could screw everything up, all of it, was qualified for this life, okay? And I'm gonna tell you something, this is a secret. What you can overcome, which I know you have some things going on in your life right now. What you can overcome, you're immensely qualified to help other people overcome those same things. And God sometimes has, has us go through these things so that we can help other people. Look, dude, do you think the world's like perfect or do you think the world's lost? 95% of the people in this world are lost. And guess what happens? When you can unscrew yourself, when you can fix yourself, when you can self-correct, when you can build this new identity, you can help millions because what you can do with you, you can do with anyone else. And since I did it to me, now I can do it to you. And now when you do it, you'll go help millions of others. I believe that. Okay, it's a law of manifestation, it's the secret, and it's the way life works. And listen, if you're listening to everything that I'm telling you during this video, is that I'm saying you're qualified, you're completely capable, this is not motivation, this is not a hype video. This is to tell you, if you truly want to change your life and change your family's life, break your bloodline, break generational curses, you have to change your identity. And you can take anyone's identity. I took the top 20, top 30 influencers in the world, the best business people, and I took the best and I left the rest. And I built me, okay? I get 100 to 150 million views every 30 days on social media. How? how? How when a normal person like me can make a decision and say, all right, I'm ready to change and I want to change for me, but also I want to go change others. It's called intentions. 
and I believe right now, and I mean this, God is asking you, is it time? Is this the video? There's the day you're born, the day you die, and the day your life changes forever. I hope you guys really watch this video 10, 15, 20 times. I hope you understand that I come to you with my heart during this video, and I wanna tell you, you have no idea what's possible when you get serious. Or you can be one of these people that, you know, like three years ago, they said they were gonna change, and two years ago, they said they were gonna change, and a year ago, they said they were gonna change. And here I am calling them out, and they're mad at me because they still hadn't changed. But they're like, Andy, serious, seriously. I'm so serious, this next time I'm seriously gonna change. You're never gonna change. Look, discipline is easy, regret's hard, okay? Over my dead body, am I gonna let my bloodline down? Over my dead body, if your bloodline has been shitty, like I've had a pretty shitty bloodline, just gonna be honest with you, can you not alter and change your DNA for the people that are to come in your bloodline, okay? Maybe it's time for you to step up and be the bloodline breaker like I am, okay? I love you guys. I appreciate you. I made this video for you so you'd understand the hack, the shortcut, the way to changing your life forever. And by the way, here's the secret. When you change, never change back, ever. That's the secret, okay? Guys, if you're watching this video down below in the description box, there's a little link that says Coach with Andy. One on one. I don't care who you are. I don't care how much money you make. I don't care if you got a business or an individual. I don't care. If you're ready to change your life, you're going to need a running mate to go with you. You're going to need someone with you. In the Bible, it says iron sharpens iron. Okay? I love you guys. Hope you have a blessed day. Go down to the description box. You can click on the link. It says Coach One on One with Andy. You literally answer you know, anywhere from eight to 10 questions. Fill out your name, phone number, email and I will reach out to you in the next 24 hours. I hope you guys have the, the courage to make a decision to change just like I did. And everybody told me that this life that I have right now wasn't possible. You know what I love? I love it when people tell me that I can't do something. You know what I do? I go do it, right? So if that's you, I love you guys. Click the link below. Let's crush it. See you in the next video.